Hey everyone, I was setting up this website recently and I wanted to buy a domain for it for a good price. So I've done some research, I compared the prices, read through a bunch of reviews and I wanted to show you guys what I found. In this video I will compare some of the best options for buying a domain, I'll walk you through the process of buying a domain and I'll explain everything along the way. Let's take a quick look at the domain name structure. The part after the last dot is called a TLD, which stands for top level domain. When we are buying a domain, we are basically choosing the middle part, domain-name in this example, in combination with some TLD, like .com in this example. Fun fact, there are around 1600 different TLDs and new ones are being added quite often. Although .com is the most popular, there are many others like .business or .trade or even .pizza, which might be worth considering when you're purchasing a domain. When it comes to buying a domain, you can't actually pay for it once and then keep it forever. You have to pay a yearly fee, which depends on the TLD and the provider. Cheapest ones like .win start around $3 per year, and the most expensive ones like .storage cost more than $500 per year. But when the domain is yours, you have the exclusive rights to it, so if anyone else wants to use it, they have to buy it from you, and you set the price. Another fun fact, NFTs.com domain was sold in 2022 for $15 million. So as you can see, there is a lot of money to be made in the domain name business. So the question now is, how do we buy a domain? Well, we have to go to a domain registrar company and buy it from them. There are many different domain registrars with uh, GoDaddy and Namecheap being the best known. Let's try typing a domain here and see what the pricing is like. Let's click on search. As we can see, the price is currently just one cent for the first year if we buy the domain for two years. So here we can see that the total price is $20. So one cent for the first year and $19.99 for the following years. Now that may sound like a good deal, but it's actually quite expensive, especially if you want to keep the domain for longer than two years. We have a similar situation here with Namecheap, $6.98 for first year with a coupon then two years for 1952, which is a bit better than GoDaddy. And then it gets more expensive at 1398 per year, which is a lot better than GoDaddy. So if you find a good deal for the first year and you're not planning to hold your domain for a long time, you can just use Namecheap. They're a solid option with good customer service and variety of other services. I've used them in the past and never had any issues. However, if you're looking for the best long-term price, I would recommend going with Porkbun. Porkbun is one of the newer domain registers. They started in 2014 and they are based in the United States. Uh, they have great reviews on Trustpilot, actually even better than GoDaddy and Namecheap. And they have been recommended by many people without actually having any affiliate marketing program. They offer a free who is privacy protection like most bigger registers do, which basically hides the personal information about the domain owner. They also offer free SSL certificates for your domains, which means that people can visit your domain securely via the HTTPS protocol. When it comes to their prices, they are quite honest and straightforward. They offer a 973 flat rate per year for a .com domain, which may not seem as good for the first year, but the renewal price for the following years is way cheaper than the others. Uh, remember that Namecheap had a renewal of 1398 and GoDaddy was 19.99, which is more than double. They tend to have first year discounts for certain DLDs from time to time, uh, but they are always upfront with the costs for the following years. And the renewal prices are among the lowest and often the lowest on the market. Now, it's true that you might be able to find a seemingly better renewal prices with other companies. For example, Cloudfare offers .com domains for a flat rate of 9.15 per year, which is actually the market rate, so they are selling it without making any profit. Cloudflare is a well-known company in the IT industry. They are mostly offering security services to other big companies. So the domain registration is not really their main focus. And because of that, they don't really have a good customer service for smaller customers, with some people even reporting not getting any answer from them whatsoever. So unless you are planning to buy a large number of domains and you are tech savvy enough so that you don't need the customer support, I wouldn't really recommend going with Cloudflare. And when it comes to other domain name registers who have lower prices, 
It might be that they just haven't built up the reputation yet, but some of them might also have a poor customer support or some hidden fees, or they don't offer the free privacy protection and SSL certificate. So keep that in mind. Now let's get back to Porkvan and purchase the domain here. I'll just click the plus button, check out. I'll just check the domain spelling one last time. I'll stick to one year and I'll click continue. I don't have the account yet, so I'll create a new account by filling out this information here. I have filled out all the required information. I've checked the terms and conditions. I clicked no, I don't want the awesome emails. And now I create the account. So the account was created and I'm back at uh, this original page where I click continue to billing. Okay, I agree to the terms again. Continue with credit card. I have filled out the credit card information. I don't check this box because I don't want anyone to store my payment information and I click pay. I have confirmed the payment on my phone and if I scroll down, I can see my domain is here. From here, I can manage the domain. I can manage the DNS settings, which I will need in order to connect it to a website. I can unlock it if I wanted to transfer it to a different domain registrar and I can even list it on the Porkbun marketplace. I would say the user interface looks quite nice and it's very simple to use. In conclusion, Porkbun really seems like the best option currently in 2023, especially if you're planning to keep your domain long term. To me, they really seem like a down-to-earth company that just tries to offer the best possible prices and the best possible user experience. I really hope this video was useful to you guys. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment. I'll be happy to help you. I will also put some useful links in the description, so check them out. That's it from me and thank you for watching.